sacrificed yourself for me. first came to the firm, we all knew you had heart. Like everybody had heard about the uh, retarded orphans. You mean Rancorp versus St. Luke's Children's Hospital? Yeah, those retards must love you. I still get the occasional card. But uh, I've noticed a change in you. Uh, how many kids did you make cry at the last trial? Five. Five. Wow. Also, the richest man in California could make a few million dollars more, huh? Sarah, you are a cold, selfish bitch. I'm sorry. No, you're not. I'm not. You keep up the good work. We like bitches here. Bitches founded this place. Bitches get the job done and they don't apologize for their drive. You keep doing what you're doing, you're gonna make partner. I found someone else. Seth, you seem like a great guy, but we've just never met. Well, uh, if you get out of the house, make some effort. Look, I'm sure you'll meet someone who's perfect for you. I'm sorry, Seth. A lot of spit in there. A lot of spit in there. Dad? Hey, honey, how you doing? Um, I'm good. If you could just sign here, I'll drop it off at the office after this. Nice work. Mm. How's Thomas treating you? Uh, he called me a bitch this morning. That means he likes you. Hmm. So, have you decided who's gonna run the firm during your campaign? Well, it's certainly not gonna be Thomas. The guy's a pussy. <sighs> so, who are you considering? Whoever it is, it's gonna have to become a partner. Which is a big commitment. They also need to have that stern family drive. <laughs> well, it's a good thing that I'm a stern. I asked Topher but... McDougal. But I'm a bitch. But Topher's a bastard, honey. Ma Don't worry. A bitch is better than a pussy. I'm making you head of PR. So I'll write speeches and stuff? No, we have speech writers. So I'll be giving speeches? No, we have speech givers. You're going to uh, appear in commercials, show up once a year, have some holiday parties, we're gonna figure out a way to put your face into the company logo. So I'm a mascot for the company now? That's a positive spin. I like it. Do I have any responsibility? Keep clean. Your face is now the face of the firm and the family. And most importantly, me. So I want you to keep this thing as soft and unspoiled as a baby's bottom. But here's the thing about a baby's bottom. They crap. And when that happens, you've got to clean it up. How will my face crap? You're still young. And of course, uh, who of us hasn't snorted a little dried panda penis off a Shanghai lady's areola, huh? My point is, when the Stearns take a dump at a party, we make sure that it ends up in the toilet, not the punch bowl. You get me? Cover up your dumps. All right, we're ready to go when you are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, fine. Action! Poor people. They used to live here. She just logged out. Her avatar just turned and it, it, it faded away. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. Princess Peach, I'm experiencing a lot of existential angst, and I just, I don't know who I am, where I am in this world. Huh? You think I should ask that girl out? 
The one who gave me the flyer? It does have her address, so that's got to be like flirting, right? Poor <laughs> person. This is like a bike ride away. I can do this. I can make something of my life. Life is full of the speed bumps and yield signs of underachievement. Remember that freeways have both on-ramps and off-ramps. Check that odometer. Only a few more miles to full self-actualization. Your fellow road warriors may shine powerful taillights, but keep your brights on and watch those blinkers. The highway of success is only blocked by obstacles of your own creation. Turn your highway into a freeway. This is the first day of the rest of my life! Close your eyes and repeat after me. No real boss. No real boss. <laughs> Just remember, keep on pushing. Push those roadblocks out of sight. Just think of what your future holds. What you have done today will change the course of your life in unbelievable ways. Notice those changes in your life. Embrace them. To receive your complimentary Guru Steve Power Crystal and Safe Crystal, send proof of purchase plus 1995 shipping and to the address listed on the reverse of your cassette case. Sorry, no CODs. And that's right by my place, so we need to stop there first. Why? If I'm gonna live with you, I need to get my stuff. So I have a Nintendo, a Nintendo 64, a GameCube, Xbox, Xbox 360, PlayStation, PlayStation 2, PlayStation 3, a Game Boy, a Game Boy DS, a Game Boy Color, Game Boy 3D, that's new, and oh, my Virtual Boy. Okay, we're not getting your stuff. Well, at least let me get a Princess Peach and my sexy sax. I don't know if you, know that about me, but I'm a sexy sax man. What's a Princess Peach? That's the most adorable dog in the world. We're not getting your dog. You, you murdered me, so the least you can do is let me get my adorable dog and sexy sax. You've had a hard day. I think you need a hug. No. Come on. No. Okay, okay, we'll get your adorable peach. Oh, get away from me. People. You gotta oh, get there's a somebody hug. coming! I look like a crazy person talking to myself! <laughs> Sarah? Sarah? Where'd you go? What's happening? Why do I feel so feminine? Uh, are you are you okay? I I'm fine. Hello, my lady. Oh, sorry. So, opening the old petting zoo, eh? Can't wait to pet some pigs. Oh, uh, you don't have pigs. Hmm. Cool. Real cool. Hey, uh, sorry I 
violated you like that. Uh, I mean, the fact that I was in in you, inside of you. I held your boobs. There are, there are no right words for this. I, uh... I'm gonna go find my sexy sex. <laughs> Can I ask you what you're doing in Seth Clay's apartment? Oops.